hey you guys welcome to my channel video with q bella i'm bella if you're new here welcome and if you're back hey babe so um as y'all can tell by the title i transformed this wig from its normal state to wah, yeah mm -hmm. They gave me this little cute baggy fashion plus i never got here with a little baggy like well they do come in you know the regular bag but never like this like i'm done it's so cute it came with the um hairnet my color thank goodness that's all it came with the um the something the wig caps not the hairnet Y'all know what I meant. Looks like I corrected myself. Um, like the last wig I did, this is 20 inches body wave. 13 by 4 lace frontal. Um, but the density on this is 180. I will be going into details about this wig after I finish everything. But um with this wig, I'm actually going to be doing something different. I'm gonna explain in a little bit. It's in a hair net, as it should be every time yes every time that's the little the body wave this hair feels nice and soft came with that this is the inside of the wig here we go again <laughs> literally it's like i'm opening the same wig again it definitely does feel thicker though um okay let me explain i'm going to be um water bleaching this wig and i'm actually thinking about i'm pretty sure i am gonna do it i'm gonna add like a little thin bang to the front i haven't done a bang in a long time and i don't show a variety of what i can do with wigs so y'all about to see today i am here with my trusty bucket um i use that every time i do water bleach and water dye to be honest um i'm gonna upgrade when I feel like it. Uh, <laughs> again, this is the um this is what I use to bleach the hair for the developer. I'm gonna put four. Okay, so I used six scoops of the um of the powder. This just smells crazy. <laughs> and um put as much liquid in it as i desired this is the inside of it that's the thickness of the bleach that's how thick that i like it um my water is boiling right now so um <laughs> Whew, god bless me when i finish i mean when the water finishes boiling i'm going to be pouring it into that and i'm going to be stirring it periodically throughout the um whoo hold on here, I'm just showing you what I meant when I said I would be pouring it and mixing it periodically. Like the text said, avoiding the clumps. Now, I'm just going to show you me putting the wig in the hot water. Okay, so I saturated the hair, plunged the hair inside of the... um inside of the bleach and everything and i covered the lid with aluminum for you so all of the heat could stay inside of the bucket um i am gonna leave it on for 15 minutes in the meantime i'm gonna be taking this wig off oh i ain't gotta do no wig cap method well that's if it don't if the wig cap don't come off with it but we about to see if i gotta do it again then i'll be prepared anyway but yeah i'm about to take this wig off while i wait Okay, so this is it after some spots clearly took lighter than the other ones. So I got to get better at this. But um, I'm actually sort of happy it did that, actually. This is the top of it. I'm going to let it dry a little bit. I think I'm going to cut the lace before but while I let it dry. Okay, so here I'm starting to, you know, part the bang and everything. I am second guessing this. Uh, you can tell, like, I'm very rusty with this thing. Like, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know what 
Okay, so I was trying to figure out if I'm really about to do this bang. Like, <laughs> I haven't done a bang in so long. But I'm going to stop punking out and do it. Like, I'm nervous as hell. I ain't even going to hold y'all. That's why I did it so, like, little. I might end up um, making it a little bit wider, maybe. I should have plugged in my flat iron instead of that. Okay, so I'm going to be um putting a little bit more hair into it, like, as y'all can see. But not too much. Um, Yeah, and I'm finally getting the courage to just go ahead and cut the bang. Like, finally. And there we have it. <laughs> And it actually did not come out as bad as I thought it would, but it can use more work. I can't lie. Okay, so it's finally uh basically dry. I actually did my nails and everything. Like it was taking a long time. I had to cook, parent teacher conference, all of that. But um, yeah, I'm about to just go over the top of my head, like flatten it or whatever. Probably um over the bang too a little bit, and then I'm gonna straighten out the rest of the hair i did not glue down the wig also either so if you see some parts lifting up just mind your business and keep watching thank you i'm just putting the last final touches to the wig basically after i've been straightened it i'm trying to straighten my part i tried to flatten the top it was acting crazy and I just like after a while it was like okay honey like this is a lot now I definitely I like low key high key feel like I lost my touch when it comes to bangs like cause what's going on over here I think I was like supposed to make it wider or something but I am finished I'm not tootling no more with this wig right now <laughs> my day has passed yeah let's talk about the wig let's talk about it. um oh snap hold i can't lie i'm low-key thinking about like um like having a blunt cut at the ends i'm not sure but it's fine for now i'm not too pressed about it um anyway information on the hair before i say how i feel about it um the company's name is fashion plus hair i don't know where that bag went um this is a 20 inch wig 13 by 4 hd lace body wave the density is 180 the price of the wig for the 20 inch is 8909 and it does have a six percent coupon when you're checking out we like coupons yeah um, <laughs> don't forget the link for this wig will be down below it's literally just like the last wig i installed to be honest that's really why i wanted to do something different with it because who wants to see the same thing back to back nah it's not the same company but it's the same type of wig the only thing is that this one is thicker than the last 20 inch body wave that i um installed but yeah um that was the information about the wig. Do I agree with the description? I do. I do. The only thing that I don't like about the wig is that, like, after I did the, um, the water bleach method, I started to see the hair shed more. Like, it wasn't shedding that much before I did it. It wasn't really shedding before I did it. So, I really don't know if the shedding was my bad. It probably is. I don't know. Or if they need like a uh, stronger hair, I guess one or the other. But I I don't know that part. So really, I'm a little iffy with the shedding thing. Everything else, it literally came as described. Literally, um, the knots. I don't have a problem with the knots. They're small. Also, so you could connect with me on Instagram. It will be down below in the description box. And for hair companies that would like to reach out to me, my business email is also down in the description box. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. 
you can definitely comment if you have any concerns or anything that you want to say thank you guys so much for watching thank you for supporting i'll see you guys next hair video